Something very important and absolutely crucial in weightlifting is confidence. So uh, when you're stepping up to a bar, especially those those one arm attempts or those heaviest weights, you have to be 100% confident. And 99% is not going to do it. Stepping up to that bar with that 1% doubt or anything beyond that is going to, to uh, mess you up. It's going to make you delay. It's going to make you hesitate and, and basically break down with a huge weight that's going to make you perhaps get destroyed and slammed by a heavy weight. So you need to make sure that as you're warming up, you stay focused in on what's going on. You have the proper mental cues. You're not over analytical on the heaviest weights. You, you, you work your technique and timing on your, on your warm up. You're not distracted by uh, peripheral conversations and noises and people. You're focused in on what you're doing. And you, your warm up was all this uh, art and science to build you up for that weight for that day that's allowed you to be 100% confident to attack that weight like a robot. Uh, if you don't develop that skill and basically anticipate your positions and hit that as hard as you can, as aggressively as possible, you're going to hesitate and miss lifts and possibly get hurt. So, um, you know, think of that as you step up to a weight. Am I 100% confident or 99%? The better and better you get and the heavier the weight gets, uh, you're going to have to make the best decision to maintain your ability to, to continue to lift well and not get hurt but also to continue to lift maximal loads and to set new PRs. It's easy when you're a beginner or an intermediate lifter, but the heavier the load gets, you need to bring 100% and then some, and then your current 100% is no longer good enough. You need to get stronger and better technically, and you gotta keep it all together and continue to build. So uh, consider that when you're stepping up to weight, and if there's any doubts in there, take a walk, get yourself mentally prepared and right for that set uh, to make sure you are 100%. Otherwise, don't take the weight, perhaps back some weight off, you can do another ramp up or wave up to the same weight again and rebuild that confidence. You can do segment uh, uh, training where you're breaking down, building back up to do that again, or it's just not in the books today. On the other hand, another way to think of this, if you're a very skilled uh, lifter and you've really got polished off technique and you're automatic and subconscious with your lifting and timing, perhaps 99% is good enough and that 1% of fear and doubt is just enough to get you to, to put everything and something superhuman into that lift. So overconfidence is not a good thing either. So uh, you, that, that can maybe make you uh, delay in terms of, you, oh, I got this, so I'm not going to necessarily put everything into it. When you have that little bit of fear in that life and death scenario uh, in your head, that 1% can do a lot for the elite level lifter who needs just enough fear to make them stay awake and alert to attack that weight with everything they have.